When building React reusable components, sometimes you want to have control over the underlying tag that's rendered into the DOM. For example, I'm going to create a reusable header component that will take the, an as prop that will control the underlying tag. This will allow me to have a single header component for every heading level. Okay, let's quickly build our header component. So const header is going to be a function component import that. And we're going to return inside of an h1 tag uh, children. Okay, let's quickly use it. Uh, header. Hello. There you have it. Let's open up this. There's a h1 tag that says hello. Okay. Let's declare our props. Interface header props. We're going to pass this prop to the function component header props. Did this. Okay. And the magic will happen on a prop that I like to call as. And this is going to be of the type react dot element type any. And this type allows for every possible HTML tag that's valid. So let's provide a default. It's going to be h1. And let's rename the prop as component. Okay. So let's change this h1 and use component instead. Okay, I just refreshed. You can see this is still an h1 tag, but if I change it as h2, saved, and there you have it. This is now an h2 element. You can do the same with span or whatever other HTML tag you want. And that's it. We have a header component that we can use for every header level. I'm sure you can see how this can enable you to make extremely useful components, allowing you to find control and also great reusability. If you have any suggestions or questions, please share them on the comment section. See you next time.